Hey guys, Joe here, Jebel Core Center. Uh, today I'm going to answer one of my subscriber question about uh, if koi fish color changes and lighten in white background. Uh, guys, yes, uh, koi fish uh, lighten when the background is white because koi fish also can uh, camouflage, can adapt to its environment, to its background. Just like a chameleon. A chameleon is a reptile. You see a chameleon with uh, large eyes and looks like a big lizard, like, like a hello, whatever. <laughs> it can easily adapt to its environment and koi fish is also like chameleon but it's not like chameleon that uh, in a few minutes a few seconds maybe i think it can easily adapt the color is it changes uh, right away uh, in koi fish it's gradual i think a few hours later you can see that its color will uh, change uh, uh, some of its pattern will color pattern will change actually especially those who have uh, a variety a, a lot of colors so that's one of the reason uh, color changes depends on its background because it can also adapt can camouflage to its background and the second reason is uh, through our perception kan ato mga pananaw ba pag interpret sa atong brain the way our brains interpret what we see uh, that is called uh, visual perception what is visual perception visual perception is the end product of vision it can be described as the way the brain interprets what the eye sees so katong visual perception ang background also the background can also influence what uh, our visual perception sees so take a look at this koi fish uh, Look at, take a look at this koi fish in white background. The color is a bit uh, light. And let's take a look at this one, the quack of koi fish with blue background. See, it changes. The red become more bright, more clear, and the white also. Same as in black background, as you can see the white color becomes more clear compared to red. And here also, if it is green background, you can see. So this is the effect of our uh, visual perception not the koi fish uh, uh, koi fish camouflage effect koi fish adapt to its environment it's for the way our brain interprets our visual so and so as you can notice all notice when I mean, there's a koi show there's a koi fish show uh, the, uh, the vat, the, the tank that holds the koi fish in the koi fish show background is blue so that uh, the judges can easily clearly see the koi fish patterns and colors here and the body conformity so 
Also, guys, not only the background can influence the koi fish color. Uh, also, the genetics. Uh, you 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 need to know who is the breeder. Uh, bloodlines. Uh, the bloodline means uh, where this koi fish uh, came from. Where what breeder? So you can notice, uh, for example, the uh, what's the famous uh, breeder of Koako is think Sakai, Sakai bloodline. Sakai means uh, the it is the last name of the breeder, the company that breeds that certain types of koi fish. So that Sakai farm means from the Sakai family is the breeder of that. So if you know where they came from, you can you will know that uh, you can actually predict that this koi koi fish uh, color and patterns will uh, remain a longer time. Since, for example, Sakai focuses on breeding kohako for many many years. So you the, you will be uh, your coffee should be guaranteed to look like this for a longer time, but also the third uh, reason for koi fish color changes is the koi food and you need to give them the best koi food you can afford. You can actually uh, create your own DIY koi food feed them to them so that the, the color will develop and will remain beautiful and fourth is the husbandry the way you care like a proper filtration and aeration because sometimes the quality of the water can uh, give also impact in the color changes if your quality of your water uh, is not good the, it's the color of the koi fish will fade especially if the wa your water is high in nitrate and it's very acid so you need to take care of your koi fish properly so that the color will remain beautiful so, if you have any question, guys, about koi fish care, koi fish disease management, koi fish breeding, and other fish keeping concerns, feel free to comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe and uh, like. One million like. <laughs> one million like. Please share and hit one million likes. Uh, so that I can create more um, koi fish care tips and answer all your questions. And hit that red bell notification button for an update mo sa new videos. Okay, bye for now. Keep safe, everyone. Stay at home. <laughs> God bless all.